hello everyone and I hope you all are doing well there and today in this video okay I'm uh, going to show you how to use in note 20 okay uh, in note x9 um, okay so if you have not in note then you can just check my channel <coughs> channel there okay there I have shown you how can we download and install in note 20 for free okay 2021 for free okay so today in this video i'm going to talk about it note 20 okay so how to use in note 20 uh, for referencing or for citation okay so in this video i'll be covering uh, the things such as uh, how can we create okay uh, create a new library or in note library or open an existing existing library uh, and after that uh, i will we'll also be showing how to import uh, references you know from an online database Mm, by uh, giving an example and similarly mm, I'll be also showing how can we use in node 20 okay in node 20 uh, in node 20 to you know just to find the full text document of PDF and download it and similarly um, in this video uh, I'll be also showing uh, how to insert a reference okay uh, into a Microsoft Word document and uh, since its output style okay so let's move ahead so we'll be starting from our uh, by just creating okay by creating in note library here you can just see uh, when you open the in note 20 after installation uh, something interface like this appears so here you can if you have already an library that is uh, or that you have already created you can just click on open an existing library and so okay so, you, so if you don't have any new library then you can create new one so I'll be showing by creating a new library uh, just click on create new library okay okay so the file name will be given my inner library that enl uh, so you can just change uh, the file name as you want okay feel free to change the f file name so I'll be just uh, giving some other names for this uh, let's say um, my thesis okay my thesis sorry yes, 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 thesis okay so let me just save this okay um, or you can just choose any uh, destination file uh, for this <coughs> in note library so I'll be choosing desktop okay okay so save okay so now uh, the in node library has been created okay so now the in node library has been created as you can see here the file name uh, I have given uh, my thesis okay so this is the interface uh, that you will see after you create uh, the in node library so here you can see all different types of references okay so recently added on file trash uh, the deleted files or the references will be just uh, collected in the address uh, my group you can just create uh, different groups okay related to different topics and many more okay so this eight node library is now empty okay because I have not added any references to it okay so let me just show you how can we uh, add uh, references from here okay so you can just see here online source okay first let me show you how can you just add references through online search okay uh, just let me click on PubMed then you can just see here uh, you can just type the okay keywords contents etc okay so just let me just uh, click title here or you can just uh, search by using the year date of year right and the title journal volume issue page number many more okay so just let me search by the title and contents uh, just let me type the keyword related to um, let's say this pandemic okay let's say COVID-19 okay COVID-19 okay then just let's search okay searching PubMed for different references okay so after you just enter the keyword or any topic or title uh, that you want to search like uh, suppose I have just uh, typed here COVID-19 so here are the different references given 
so in in note okay just remember that in note uh, will retrieve the first 25 search results okay and similarly you will have other source options okay uh, to download for additional reference okay so if you want okay so let me just import this now uh, let me just select uh, the journals that I want okay uh, you can just select all okay just let me select all and just click on this add button okay you can see here right okay just click on there okay then you can see there uh, recently added 25 okay so this is not saved in your library yet okay so you can just see here on file okay it will be just stored in on file there because uh, we have not any created uh, groups here okay we have just created a library okay so now just let me create a group okay and just add let's add these references to it for that just go to the file menu uh, sorry uh, groups then click on create group okay so you can just see here uh, you can give any name as you want so let me give the name just as uh, COVID-19 COVID-19 okay so it's created okay so in this group uh, let us add all these uh, references that we just imported f uh, from online search select all then you can just drag okay drag to this group okay now it's saved in group okay you can see here okay so this is one method and in another method okay um, uh, automated referencing uh, capturing um, which is also known as uh, direct export okay we can just directly export from um, any uh, web browser directly there okay so you can also use the direct export uh, you know workflow to capture references with many online databases as we have just seen here okay so let me just show you um, or show you by importing some references from uh, let's say PubMed okay PubMed.gov okay okay so for that just open any of your browser mm, okay then just grab there PubMed PUB PubMed.gov okay so I'm using your Google Chrome so if you use your Mozilla Firefox okay that will be very much uh, easier because uh, Mozilla Firefox you know it uh, supports direct exports on both Windows operating system and Mac operating system okay <coughs> okay so after that let me just uh, type the keyword here that is COVID-19 okay then just hit enter okay you can see here okay so after that just uh, click on send to as you can see then click on citation manager okay send to click on citation manager then you can see create click on create file okay so after that you can just see here the file has been downloaded here Bob made COVID right okay just click on there okay then the file will be uh, just updated in EndNote okay so you can see here in this EndNote uh, you can see here imported references right it's here given 10 okay and recent files 45 on file 20 okay so in previously we created the group COVID-19 that is uh, there are 25 references so in this on file okay uh, the exported references will appear you know uh, just within an imported imported references okay or temporary group okay so, so you can see here this okay so now uh, in this process okay the process to initiate you know our direct export to in node uh, may just be different from uh, or it will be different from uh, site to site okay so you can just uh, view or you can just uh, search for the terms like saving exporting or you know just importing references 
like that okay okay so let me just add all this uh, just select then just repeat the process drag all the references to my groups okay okay so you can see here okay all it's I've all just exported to my groups here okay so after that okay so you can just see these are all references okay so I didn't have the PDF or full PDF to all these okay you can see here it's just the summary <coughs> okay so now I just want to download the PDF related to these references okay so how can I do that now okay okay so to find out you know um, or to have in note attempt or just to find out the full text PDF so for references okay which are in our library okay so in this group uh, you can just select the references or uh, that you want to download the PDF okay so let me just search for all the okay references that are just exp imported here okay then after that you can just uh, click on the shortcut button here okay search the web uh, full text documents for the selected references okay then click there wait for a few minutes or a few time okay it's searching not found three Mm, okay so you can just see here find the full text here right uh, not found 19 uh, found URL 3 not found 13 okay so you can just see here right the paper clip the picture of the paper clip okay you'll see the paper clip icon just uh, next to the selected uh, for which the in note finds a PDF okay so in note I uh, found the PDF for these references okay so you can just click here and you can just see the article that is here okay the PDF file you can just see and that will be here okay you can just open this okay so now here you can just see or view the full article here okay okay impact of COVID-19 pandemic on the care of uh, cancer patient in Spain okay so here you can just review right like this okay so in this way you can just download the PDF for all the uh, references that you have just uh, exported okay okay so now after this okay uh, after this uh, or, or the after this when all the references appears in your you know in dot library just you can just see it uh, all these references okay uh, just remember the topic here the impact of COVID-19 right okay I've just taken a few uh, things from it okay so uh, you can just see here okay so in Microsoft Word, okay so this is the conclusion that I just uh, retrieved from that document here you can just see here okay uh, from this okay so I want to cite this to my Microsoft Word okay so how can I do that okay uh, just click the cursor where you want to cite okay so I want to cite here okay I'll be putting my cursor here then after that just click on in node 20 you can see here click there then you can just see here insert citation here insert citation you can just see or you can just see the shortcut button here click on there okay so you can just see here okay the in note library it opens automatically here okay so my keyword was COVID-19 obviously it was so search in libraries okay okay that's all done already COVID-19 okay let's find once more okay so okay uh, I just retrieved from this PDF right the impact of COVID-19 pandemic on the care of uh, cancer patient in Spain okay so I want to you know just cite this reference how can we do that now just click on that alright then click on insert okay here we are now see it's so much easier 
okay so this is in this output style okay uh, is in the form of APA style so if you want to change this uh, you can just go to here yeah, style right APA 7 you can just choose uh, other output style okay so for now let me just take as fan cover okay see it changes automatically or numerically here right okay one and it automatically saves everything here okay so you can change from here now you can select any other uh, references output style okay yeah okay so now just let me keep as it is uh, APA style okay okay so now uh, let's say I want to add the page number to this reference system so, okay so now how can I add that okay okay for that just select the citation then go to up uh, in uh, edit and manage citations okay yeah okay so now you from here you can add prefix suffix and page number also here okay you can just see okay so uh, let's say okay uh, let me add just page number 14 okay I right from page number 14 then just click on okay okay so now we are the page number also arrives here okay page number 14 so there you yeah. okay so in this way you can just use in note okay uh, and so you also can do much more things uh, by using in note 20 okay so uh, if the video was really advantageous for you all guys uh, please hit the like button and subscribe my channel for more videos like this in uh, upcoming days till then everyone take care and stay safe bye bye everyone and thank you